and how I kind of forgot to tell my wife that I was spending money on Amazon. G'day everybody and welcome back to Mozzie Garden and Kitchen. Daz here. I thought I'd share this mail delivery with you today since I'd been talking to some of you recently about some of the things I'd ordered and how I kind of forgot to tell my wife that I was spending money on Amazon. Ah well. Anyway, um, let's get to it. Uh, first of all, I got this triple pack of bags here. They came like this. And I'll just chuck these aside. Okay, I got a three pack of these grow bags. Pretty much hang them. And they have pockets. So you can put strawberries and herbs and stuff like that. And I'm really stoked. These were on special and I couldn't resist. Um, they're a nice looking material. I think, I don't know what you call it, but I think they'll last a while. What I like about these is that I can hang them around in my fresco above me outside and then turn them around every few days to give things a decent amount of sun. So I might have, say, I don't know, strawberries or, strawberries or herbs, and I'll have them facing the sun. And then in a few days' time, I can unhook it, turn it around, and then give the other guys on the other side a good dose of sun. So yeah, I'm pretty stoked about that. So I've got three of those. So I'm looking forward to filling these and eventually planting them out with Probably herbs and strawberries are um, my thinking at the moment. All right, next thing I got was grow bags. So excuse the noise. Um, I'm pretty late to the party with grow bags. I've only discovered grow bags recently and oh man, they're so awesome. I, I wish I'd found them earlier, especially um, because in this region I get frosts and it's good to be able to just be able to pick something up and pull it out of the frost and then put it back out into the sun the next day. So we don't get frost constantly, but we get them occasionally at certain times of the year. So it'd be good to keep an eye on the forecast and say, hey, look, there's a frost coming tonight. Just go and grab it by the handles, put it aside. Next morning, beautiful sunny day, pop it back out and yeah, it's in its spot again. So yeah these guys sorry about all the crumbling noises these guys are seven gallon bags and i've actually got the 10 gallon off this cellar uh previously and they're good quality so as you can see there that that's the cell seven gallon size so pretty happy with these. There's the handles. And you can see on the inside here that there's stitching opposite the handles. So I assume that's gonna be a bit more strength. It's not just gonna tear through the fabric. So yeah, anyway, that was a five pack. And they came with some free gloves. in really hard to open plastic. Okay, so these were just freebies. I was gonna buy them anyway because I already liked the bags that came from this particular seller in Australia. But, oh, these feel really good. All right, pretty stoked. But check this out. These, <laughs> check out that. I feel like Freddy Krueger. One, two, what, uh, what's the Freddy Krueger song? Yeah, anyway. But no, that's, that's different. It's, um, okay, they don't come off. All right, so. That's pretty cool though for digging in the dirt and yeah it's not bad for a freebie as i said i was buying the grow bags anyway so these were just chucked in with the sale um actually while i think of it i've got a really cool cooking video coming up soon so keep an eye out for that because i know a lot of you like the cooking segments i do 
so stay tuned in the coming days I'll say no more actually just have to wait and see all right now this is the third thing I got and I'm really stoked about this I was talking to some of you about how um, in recent times I discovered the grow mats and how a grow mat was really fast in germinating germinating my seeds sorry I can't talk properly today and to go with my grow mat I've got myself a bum 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 grow light so I'm pretty stoked about this so I don't know how to do this all right so in the packet it can come with a hanging kit so to hang it actually that's a good point I'm going to have this indoors and I'm not sure how to set it up so if any of you have any suggestions and ideas pop it down in the comments give me some ideas if you don't mind on how I can set my grow light up with my grow mat on this table here actually because I've never done it before and it's really new to me and yeah I'd appreciate some help because um, I bought it and I don't know how exactly to set it up anyway um, all right it's a user manual and let's have a look see oh sweet it comes with stickers all right I'll show you uh, you know what that's pretty cool okay so I went with the Mars Hydro because I believe um, they're pretty well respected and have some really good reviews um, I like those stickers they're cool kids are gonna love them all right so for me importantly it came with an Aussie power plug so all you Aussies watching um, this one that I bought on Amazon Australia comes with an Aussie plug very important all right well that's the LEDs and this is one of their there you go Mars Hydro I'll put the actual name in the description and might pop it up on the video uh, it's a, like a TS 600 or something and this is one of the newer models where apparently I think they've added this reflective type edging so it reflects light a bit more than previous models um, so it's got all the LEDs in there and I'm pretty sure there's some infrared ones in there as well um, I need to check the specs on that but yeah I'm pretty stoked kind of did not tell my wife about spending the money on this so this was about 119 Australian dollars so that was not exactly a a small amount of money to be spending and not telling my wife because I share everything with my wife and yeah anyway she's fine with that because she knows my gardening makes me happy and it was my birthday just a couple of weeks ago hang on what, what day is it about a week ago it was my birthday so she said you know what happy birthday so pretty stoked so there you go guys this is my mail call for today um grow bags which i can't wait to get into i've got my light which please ideas on how to hang it or frame it or something like that um if you've got videos on your channels about how to set one up and everything please link it in the description do not be shy um, that's perfectly fine by me uh, what else did I get the um oh the hanging bags really keen to set these up and yeah um, one thing I'm really lacking here at the moment is a proper herb garden I have random things around and seasonal oh well okay sorry about that light just fell and scared the absolute crap out of me um yeah so i plant 
herbs kind of seasonally and don't really pay attention to them enough, which is crazy because I cook a lot and I really should have herbs at hand. So anyway, herbs. I'm looking forward to loading up one of these with herbs and having herbs and, as I said, spin it around every few days to give them sun. So yeah, there you have it. So this is my mail delivery for the day. Pretty stoked. As I said earlier, I've got a pretty cool cooking video coming up really, really soon in the next day or so. So keep an eye out for that because I think you'll like it. All right, I think that will do. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it. Oh, actually, just before I go, if anyone's still watching this video clip, I hit 50 subscribers the other day and that's really tiny compared to a lot of people. But for me, I'm stoked just to know that there's even a few people out there that actually bother to watch my stuff. It's awesome. And um, what I do like is the friendships I'm making and it's not just going to people's channels and doing a thumbs up and then dropping it and going away, but I really enjoy the banter and the, the laughter in the comments I'm having with people. So many of you that I've really connected with and I'm really enjoying watching your channels and having fun in the comments. And yeah, anyway, guys, this is dragging out a bit too long. So thank you, all of you. Yeah, all right, I'm sort of, going off on a, I, I don't know. Anyway, thanks very much guys. I appreciate it and I will see you next time. Cheers.